Does this seem more cat? Does this seem more casual? <laughs> This is how I sit in my house all the time. <laughs> Light, camera, check, action. Welcome to the video. I haven't seen you guys in a little while. My last couple videos have been topic based videos. So today we're gonna do a full day of eating, vlog, train and be merry type video. I just wanna catch you up on just things that are going on with me. One of which that is probably the most exciting things because my life is very boring is that I got a haircut yesterday. And when the most exciting thing that has happened to you is a haircut, you need to get out more. Okay, so it's officially right before I'm about to get my hair cut. Can we just take a moment and appreciate the fact that I'm not in gym clothes and I'm in regular clothes? This is what we're looking like before. One day, I've talked about this with Jeff, I might chop all of my hair off. You'll have to let me know if any of you guys mm -hmm. think that's a good idea mm -hmm. or how many of you guys think that's a terrible idea. But anyways, I'm also gonna go to the gym, book updates, just Hanging out with you. Hungry, I'm gonna have some breakfast, so let's make some breakfast. Ten o'clock, feeding for the guap. I be beaming, losing balance, so bitch falling on my job. They're like, okay. So, time for breakfast. I have an egg scramble that I put onions, mushrooms, and spinach in, and I topped it with feta cheese. And then I also have some Kodiak pancakes, which I love, I've been having those a lot lately, and I threw some blueberries in them. Normally when I eat breakfast, I usually either read or listen to an audiobook, so I'm gonna listen to that. Let's dig in, I'm hungry. All done. That was delicious. I feel after a meal that size pretty full. This morning, I was actually writing the portion of my book where I recap the 10K challenge. I actually still have in my fitness pal what I ate from the 10K challenge. Like I went to February 25th, 2017, and it's all there. And I was like, oh my God, my first meal alone, I ate 3,300 calories. There's no way I feel full after this. And I just ate two pancakes and some eggs. It's crazy to me. It blows my mind. I don't even know. I wonder how I would do if I were to do the 10K challenge mm -hmm. now. Like, oh my God, I would have, no, I would, I would fail it probably so miserably. Do worse so, than me. Probably. <laughs> I can't even fathom it. Crazy. Really quick before I go to the gym, I wanted to share with you um, the shorts that I'm wearing because I really love them and I think that you guys would really like them too. And then a pair of leggings that I love from Amazon. I don't really get a lot of opportunities to share like clothing related things to you unless you follow me on Instagram. If you are interested in the things that I'm wearing, definitely follow me on Instagram. But these shorts, I bought them myself. They are from Alphalete and I'm actually super impressed with them. Like they have a scrunch detail here. I know that it's really popular with brands with doing that but they like really nailed it I know that's like a straight butt shot but I feel like they're extremely flattering they also have no front seam which I love that brands are doing now so this is another color that I have in them and I just think that they're I feel like they're just really nice I'm really impressed by them so apparently these leggings are like super popular on TikTok. I think I just wanted to pick them up to see what all the hype was about so they also have no front seam which is really nice they also have that scrunch booty detail that's obviously really popular right now. They're not gonna be for everybody, but I figured I'd show them to you because I kinda like them and they're pretty cheap. Gym time.
So I just finished up my workout. It went really well. I think my deadlifts went really well. I feel like I've been feeling really good, really strong. My back has been feeling really good. After I did deadlifts, I just finished up with a bunch of accessory movements. As much as my channel has like evolved into like literally everything, even though I kind of started in fitness, I still love and enjoy working out. I am really trying to train for strength. And I think that it's just made the gym so much more enjoyable for me. If you're really struggling with maybe a little bit too focused on like the physique component of fitness, I would just try just for fun to try to like switch your focus a little bit to the strength aspect of lifting and not just doing it to look better because when you focus so much on that, it can become overwhelming and fitness will lose that sense of fun for me personally. So if you are struggling with that, I, I definitely recommend giving that a try. If you guys are interested in my training programs, I do have training programs for at home, in the gym, for beginners, intermediates, and advanced level lifters. If you guys are interested in building strength and muscle, I will leave a code down below for my YouTube family if you want a discount off of one of my programs. But yeah, so I finished up my workout and now I'm gonna go home, get cleaned up, and get something to eat. So typically after the gym, I get dressed and I actually come to Panera Bread, which I know is really random, but it's actually like a really peaceful and quiet place to work. And I've been sleeping on Panera because Panera actually has really good food. They have really good sandwiches love me some sandwiches and they have really good like rice bowls which I think is what I'm gonna get today I've been craving their Baja bowl with chicken it's really good try it if you haven't when you work at home sometimes you need a change of scenery so I usually come three to four times a week and I always get something to eat when I come it's really quiet really nice so we're gonna do that today I'm gonna do some work on my computer and get something to eat so I'll see you in there lemon drop cookie oh my god that was so good it's definitely my favorite cookie from Panera I've had their chocolate chunk chipper I've had their oatmeal raisin I've had their cinnamon twist bun things but that lemon drop cookie it has like white chocolate chips in it and the inside was like buttery and delicious if you like lemon I highly recommend that cookie I'm a good girlfriend because I actually saved half of it for Jeff I want him to try it because it kind of blew my mind. But anyways, I'm gonna go home and do a little bit more work. I'll see you in a little bit. Rolling. Rolling? Let's do this. Okay, so I'm gonna read you guys a little something. Um, I'm gonna read you the prologue. All right. Prologue. Breathing heavy and profusely sweating while attempting to pull on my third pair of leggings, I began to mentally reprimand myself for my pathetic lack of any cardiovascular endurance while simultaneously attempting to give myself a pep talk on all the reasons not to cry. Trust me when I say that there were no victors in the intracranial boxing match I was having. Don't cry, I whispered to myself as I flopped onto the edge of the bed, leggings midway up my thighs. Feeling completely defeated and still breathing heavy, I started to wriggle out of the two small pair of leggings and pulled with all of my might at the bottom hem to rip them off. I threw them aside and I decided I would just have to wear a pair that I knew fit me, but also keenly aware were dirty from wearing them for the past two days. They were a size large, one of the few pairs I had in that size from a recent shopping trip. I dug through the dirty laundry, still a little out of breath, this time not from putting on the leggings, but from removing them, and pulled out the pair that I was looking for. They were inside out, covered in lint, and pilling where my inner thighs rubbed together. They were looking pretty rough, and I knew that I should probably get another pair. Ugh, looks like I need to go shopping, again. Considering my precarious position, I was actually in a really good mood. Before all of my attempts to get dressed, I had just finished eating a very satisfying breakfast of a big bowl of oatmeal topped with bananas and peanut butter. I was feeling rather triumphant that the bowl of oatmeal, albeit a somewhat large bowl, was all I needed to feel full. I would have never believed this was possible six months ago, and I was starting to feel like everything I had gone through the past six months was worth it. It's working, I thought to myself while smiling. Exhaling and blowing a strand of sweaty hair out of my face, I looked up into my closet, hands on my hips, and thought, 
Now, all I need to find is a top that fits. Nice. So I sent that to my editor. I sent a chapter over to my editor. I'm working on many other chapters simultaneously, but the next one I'm working on is kind of going back in time. The timeline isn't perfectly linear, but I think it works with the story. I promise it's gonna be good. Okay, pizza? Let's do it. Pizza. Excited? Hot. hot. It is. Super hot. I'm wearing a sweater. Okay, what one first? Green margarita. So, I'm close. <laughs> I might have to voice over this because the music is really loud. So I will definitely have to tell you what I thought of everything in the car after. Well, margarita first. Queen margarita. Queen margarita. Oh my god. Bruh, you like it. Whoa, that like shook me. Okay. The crust is so like, I don't know. You know how you take a bite pizza, you like, yeah. it's like not like that at all. It's like, it's like biting into a croissant. Mm. You see what I mean? Yeah, crazy, bro. I know. Damn, that's really good. Yeah. Wow. It's like toast almost. Yeah. But in a good way. Toast on the bottom. Yeah. I didn't know how to describe it. I've never it. had pizza like that. Yeah, me neither. It's incredible. I've literally never had anything like this in my life. Mr. Clean is coming for that ad rev. You like it? It's really good. talk <laughs> that was honestly the best pizza I've ever had in my life like it was 10 out of 10 blew me away never had anything like it I don't even know what I just ate no words my favorite piece was the Queen's margarita the second favorite was probably the base the pesto so my two were my favorite that's gonna complete the video I'm feeling full very satisfied two slices of pizza you're good I'm good. Like the video if you liked it. Subscribe if you happen to be new. I would love to have you. And I will see you in a video very soon. Mwah. Love you.